skating coach for the Dutch, the, the Dutch, excuse me, you've made Olympic history because your team has won more medals in a single sport in a single Olympics. Yeah. 21 medals. A single team, a single sport, a single yeah, Winter Olympics. Uh, come. Yeah, and we wanted to have you on originally because there's all this controversy about the Under Armour suit that the Americans long track was wearing and whether or not that was a cause. And I wanted to ask you, do you think that that was one of the reasons why the Americans didn't do well, the suit? Yeah, the suit was one of the reasons, but not because it was bad, but because they believed it is bad. Because for skating, you have to believe in yourself, like Americans always do. Americans always believe that they're right, always believe that they're the best, yeah? But that's not true. When you just go abroad, yeah, and you look at the rest of the world, yeah, you can stay inside, in your own country. You can make an own game, like American football, yeah? Do it your own and think you're the best of the world. But no way, when you play soccer, man, you're just not half. You're not belonging Five, to the top eight. 30 of the world. Oh. So, so quit when you come every four years, you come to an Olympic Stadium and you want to fight the rest of the world, then you know your place right. and you hey, got Michelle. zero medals. Michelle. Zero, man. Michelle, uh, all right. yeah, okay, that's... Coach, Coach, thanks for coming on. Number one, <laughs> number, number one, I got two words for you, just two words, Eric Hyden. Eric Hyden's from Wisconsin. <laughs> All right, number one, yeah. he, was, he was good in the, yeah. he was good in short track, yeah. and he was good in seven. And here's number two. Yeah, and I'm gonna I, go, I'm gonna go, uh, man, I'm gonna, I can t I can tell you something else. Shawnee Davis is, I think, the best skater there ever was. It's an American. Okay. But let's they go on to, let's are go on just to addicted. They are addicted oh, okay. to the movement. All right. All right. When you once go over the ice right. with 50k an hour through the corners, yeah, you live up to that action and you want to perfectionize that movement. And then you get addicted. But they're oh. lone wolves. Hold they're addicted on. and hold they on. don't hold get on. money. Don't don't no, I'm not holding oh, on. I you already on. have your say. You, you already have your say. Your you already have your say. Just listen to my premise here. Coach, coach, listen. Listen to me. I watched a 10,000 meter race yesterday. Two people not even racing each other around and around and around for 13 minutes. Every once in a while, they cross over and go around. I, I think watching paint dry is more fun. I want my 13 minutes back of my life. I want that time back that I spent. Are you actually comparing, are you actually comparing the spectator experience of speed skating with American football? No, sir. What I'm comparing is that the emotion that's involved when two guys are heading for the win and going as fast as they can on a very honest sport. There's no tricks involved. It's just about who is the best in the world. Eric Hyde. And when you, you are not any more <laughs> interested in being the best of the world, well, stay in your country, do your own sport, yeah? Don't compete with the rest of the world, but don't ask the question why you didn't win medals. Because you didn't. And that's why I'm here in the studio you know, to coach, talk to you coach, and to explain to you why you didn't win any medals. Coach, coach, the other thing, <laughs> the other thing is I hear Euro envy here again, especially now, and, and from the Netherlands, sort of a kind of a third tier Euro country, your entire economy, your entire economy is $770 billion. We're $16 trillion. But that's no reason to be bitter. I mean, back in, that was a great book in 1865 about Hans Brinker. You can always hang your hat on that. That's the last big thing that's happened over there. I, I'm, uh, am I allowed to tell you anything about our country? Yeah, yes. when we sell our companies, yeah, to the world, we all be billionaires. When we sell the Shell, yeah, you know, uh, the the our the company, our company mm -hmm. when we when we sell Unilever, when we sell Aegon, when we sell all our companies, man, you're broke when you want to buy them. <laughs> so you just steal quiet because you're doing very well, and we are just our economy doesn't spend a lot of money because we are just. Tell, tell you, you don't like American football as a no, sport. No, 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 no. No, that's not, that's no, not true. No, you said they that. kill each no, other. No, yeah. I like their commercials uh, very much. <laughs> there are a lot of humor involved. So I, I love the Seahawks win against all odds. Oh, and, uh, now it's coming out. No, that's now a, we see. You do love no, it. You yeah, do yeah, like it. No big deal. 
No, no big deal. But All right, what's you your have advice? a sport, and a lot of your talent is wasted in that sport because you kill each other <laughs> in the American football. It's so rough. And, and because you like it and you got all the money into that sport, there's not a lot of money in the other sports. And just nobody in the world wants to compete in that sport with you. And you're saying all, all our best athletes are going to that sport rather yeah. than to the other sports like speed skating. Exactly. And there is so much money involved in American football. And the money that's involved in that is not into, uh, into speed skating. And when you see in our country, we have all teams, they're fighting each other, like the American way, the survival of the fittest. Like our basketball. Like the basketball. Right. And you don't ask the question why you win in the Summer Olympics always with your dream team. But you now come <laughs> and you ask the question, how come you win so much medals in speed skating? Well, man, because, because you're saying speed skating in the Netherlands is kind of like our basketball. Exactly. It's very competitive, lots of teams, exactly. lots of money, it's and then they go to the Summer Olympics and they beat everybody. Exactly. And that's, and I love basketball. And when we end in the States, we always go to basketball games. Who's your favorite team, an American player? Uh, the f yeah, they're all new. The, oh, they're all okay. New. But uh, but of course we go to the Milwaukee Bucks or uh, when we're in the stadium and um, Salt Lake, Utah Jazz. Yeah. Okay. And that's so we we see the the teams and we favorite the Utah Jazz. Joe, he he held you off pretty good. Wait, no, 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 no. Wait a minute. Now, we got fo football, <laughs> basketball. You we can't got stand losing. You must be an American. 21, man. 21 <laughs> medals all out of 22. All you do is speed skate. That's it. I mean, life is about yeah, well, variety and diversification. You, you do one thing. I mean, seriously, I you, that's all you got? That's it? Speed skate around and around and around and around and around. <laughs> and around. Yeah, yeah, Come yeah, yeah. on! Well, the, I, I think that the gold medal that's in speed it? skating is just as valuable as a gold medal in basketball. Coach, you call and, me when you win and something else. we won 22, else. and you will never you win know, 22 in basketball, in man. So I think we're clever. Stuff. Stop in the leak. Anything else, your tulip bulbs, anything else you find that you're good at, you let us know. All right? You're we'll be just with... envious, man, for our medals. That's what you do. <laughs> you're you, just you envious. No big deal. You no big deal, me. man. We're flying. We're separated we don't at hit the ground anymore. We're yeah. on a cloud. We're separated at birth. You remind me of something John so Cleese similar. said one time, <laughs> which was really great. He said, how come only the Americans could come up with something called the World Series and not invite any other countries? Exactly. So that's a fair point, exactly. Coach.